back to Co Miss Coco Air. Um, I just wanted to do a quick video um, to show y'all the bag that I bought. So I'm gonna use my um, work phone so I can show y'all. So I did the uh, Kirk Geiger London Square Basket Handbag. And if you can see it, I'm gonna zoom in. So I'm gonna show you the one I ordered, but Nordstrom need to send me another one because this particular one that I received had like scuff marks and I will show y'all in a second. So this is it. I think that was it. So it was just five pages. So, well not five pages, but five um, photos of it. Um, so this is the basket one. Um, I said I wasn't gonna get it, but I did it anyway, because it was on sale. The retail price for this was $99. Um, it was 40% off, which make it $59.40. So let me, I don't know if I can zoom in. Let me do it before I get into this. You probably can't even see it. Hopefully y'all can see it. But yeah. I'll put the information, um, the link in the description of my video. So of course, this is the Kurt Geiger bag that come in. So the replacement should be coming sometime this week. But because you know of what's going on in the world, um, it may take a while to get to me. But normally I get my stuff within five days. But right now, with all of this going on, I've been shopping and then spraying down my stuff. So I did find out I didn't ruin a lot of my outfits. I probably messed up this too. But of course, you know, and then I sprayed this plastic. But again, they didn't do nothing to the bag. Um, so this is the... Uh, the basket. Um, so this is it, the square basket. Um, you, if you can see, you see like little scuff, and I don't even know if I get a replacement, would that even help? But this is scuff as well, and these are uh, like marks on. And again, this is like, what material is this? Before I get into it, this material is different, so it's gonna have little marks on it. It's not even telling me. Um, it's pretty much like a basket. I mean, duh. So um, the chain is just like the silver one. Um, it's a long strap. It's crossbody. And of course you got the Kurt Geiger bird on it. And of course you get this telling you about it. Of course I told you how much it was. So it's, it's a decent bag. Nice bag whenever I can get out the house. I'm hoping the replacement will be better than how this one is. Um, but it's real heavy. It's magnetic, of course, and just closed. I probably can't get anything in here but my phone, wallet, um, probably lipstick, and other little necessary things I need in here. But for the most part, it's a nice, decent bag. It's, it's The strap is pretty long a nice bag i think i would like it um it stopped at my hip so it's, it's good it's, it's kind of I, I don't want to say it's light but it's it's a it's a nice weight to it and let me look in here real quick sorry to keep looking down but i want to make sure and i'm going to put the information in it anyway but yeah it's 0.9 pounds so yeah and the uh, uh strap is 23 inches crossbody uh strap drop so yeah, it's a nice size. I don't even know if I can, y'all can see all of this. I'm not gonna even try. But good thing I was able to show y'all the photos. But right now, yeah, I know she's having like a 40% sale and y'all probably can take advantage of that. I bought another bag, um, but I'll show y'all the video of that. And I'm thinking about getting a wallet, just a card holder, cause that would be pretty nice to put in here. I'm hoping the replacement is better than what this is with the scuff because I don't even know if I can do much. I can put polish and then some type of seal, but that's going to pretty much require me to dip the whole bag and it's not doing that. Um, so yeah, not really feeling well, but at the meantime, I feel like I should just buy something since it's a sale and of course I'm saving. These are, this is funds that, you know, I can afford to get a little something for myself. You know. um, my allergy is killing me. So I've been taking the Claritin. Of course, my vitamins. Don't like tea. Didn't like tea. 
but I'm drinking the substituting the honey other than you know using the sugar trying like a trick my thing even though I don't like tea but um, again I think I really do because it's been helping me a little bit um, I have went outside to get a little bit air because this quarantine I've been quarant been working from home since March the 13th and this been it's been really 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 different for me um, been in the house and then when I go outside um, of course I don't know if I mentioned this I'm quite sure I probably did but the anxiety um, it's been pretty much hard for me to sleep um, things in that nature I have to meditate more I have been using my um, oculus to it's an app on there you can download for um, to meditate and everything it's not working um, but I have been taking deep breath um, to get me through this um, of course try to use shopping but that's not helping because you got to be careful with the packages and everything I am Lysol and everything I'm ordering food have not went to the grocery store um, I have been doing instant instacart instacart and I've um, been pretty much working for me um, of course I got to pay attention because sometimes they don't have everything you need you have to substitute it so if you get if you have not used that I definitely recommend that for you because even if they don't have um, what you um, like you can always pick a different option or you can pretty much say no option and that way you'll just get credit back on your credit card or your um, debit card um, but for the most part this is my fourth time and I have something coming today um, of course the price is gonna be totally different from when you go in the actual store but it's pretty much benefit me because of the anxiety um, and the, the stuff that I have to put on to go out the gloves and then I got the freaking mask on and I'm not talking about just a regular mask like y'all let me show y'all the mask I've been using. Y'all gonna be like, girl, you tripping? I've been using this when I go out. And I gotta try not to walk too fast because Lord knows I might hit the floor. But I use this, um, just cover everything. And then um, and then I put my gloves on. I make sure I don't touch the outside part of it. Um, once, you know, because of course, you don't want to touch it and then touch the inside what's the purpose of you wearing it i make sure when i get to the car i'll spray the outside with the um lysol and then use you know sanitize it and the chloride wipes and rewash it because of course i don't want to inhale with clorox um chemicals so i make sure i do that and then i take my gloves off throw it in the trash come in the house take the clothes off throw it in the machine that's if that's too much then i'm sorry uh i just you know it's to the point you don't even know if it's your allergies or it's just something serious so i'd rather just do the right thing and wear that because i did have to go out for a second on what was it saturday just for a second just to get a couple things um but it wasn't um grocery it was just like a, a pickup an item i had to pick up at Target, like a pick curbside uh, pickup. So I did do that. I do miss going out, but for right now, this is the norm that we are pretty much dealing with at this moment. It's very, very, very di different. Um, I know my anxiety shouldn't be as high as it is, um, but you just scared, you know? You don't even know how long this been here. Um, Y'all just want to make sure y'all all being safe. I'm um, using precautions. Please do that. Wear your gloves and your mask. If you don't have to come out, please do not come out. Um, not for dumb reasons. Um, of course, you take a walk and all of that. But for me, I'm just, you know, with the anxiety, I'm just standing on the porch. If I'm getting to the car, I'm in there, roll the windows up. Like, it's just extra. Um, I'm not riding with the mask, but if I have to step out, I have the mask on um but again i will keep y'all updated again they will be sending me a replacement on this bag because this one is pretty much damaged and i will have to send it back once i receive the other one and there was there they will be sending me well in that package i will have my return label so i'll be sending this back um and of course get my replacement and then i have another bag i ordered um it was 
reasonable. It wasn't nothing like crazy. At this point, I'm just doing reasonable because prices on things because you don't know how serious things gonna get, how soon it's gonna get better. Um, so I, even though I am shopping, but it's reasonable shopping like always. Um, but again, yeah, make sure y'all being safe. And I'll show you the new um, bag that I ordered, which was, I think it was $44. So um, I have not ordered any makeup or anything um, since I did my last video. I'm still waiting on my Morphe. Haven't gotten that yet, and I know it's due to what's going on. Um, so they told me it's going to ship within three to five days, and it's understandable. You know, that's fine. Totally fine. Not in a rush. Because, again, I'm quarantined, and I'm in a house, and I'm... Um, been, you know, get my time in looking at things on Netflix to get me right. So yeah, I just wanted to come in and show y'all one of the little goodies that I got last week. And um, so yeah, I'll keep y'all updated and make sure y'all stay safe and live life to the fullest. Thank you for tuning in to Miss Coco. Love y'all.